What's up, guys? Before we start today's vlog, I want to give a plug out to my boy, JJ Armstrong, who's in Southwest Florida, because JJ's involved in this, uh, a, it's a raffle. It's a raffle for a, a seriously cool truck. This is the, this is the truck right here. But there's not that many days left on this raffle and tickets are available. Well, the best thing to do is there's a link right down in the show notes just below. Click that link and you'll be able to see exactly what he's got going on. It's a 1957 GMC Suburban and the tickets are the 25 bucks. It's not that much and you do help people in Southwest Florida, you know, it, it, with all the hurricane stuff, you know, a lot of things, a lot of bad stuff happened. This is a way to help out. It says this vehicle has been raffled off to one lucky winner to benefit Eva's foundation a 501c nonprofit charity that provides clothing, food, and other necessities for those in need throughout Southwest Florida with dignity, honor, and respect. Website, website right right here, Eva's Foundation. Be sure to check them out. Uh, buy a ticket, quickly buy a ticket because the 25th is when the, the thing, I'm not even sure what the date is today, but it's only a few days away, so you gotta get to it. JJ, good on you, buddy, for, uh, for making this thing happen. I hope somebody wins it. And if they do, send me a picture of them standing next to that car. You know, take a look at some of these shots of this truck. It's really sweet in and out. Uh, I, I love trucks that are yellow like this, but just look how clean the motor is, man. That is sick. And the vehicle was donated by Cali Motors. There, I guess they're a customizer that's out in Florida. Not really sure, gotta go. We got some things to do on the block today. without necessarily looking behind me for a very good reason. But we have a problem today, a very serious I don't have a problem. problem. But you don't have the problem, I got the problem. And that is, what are we gonna drive today? Because we have more than one car, we have two. Is that we have some things to do today, but we have two cars. The first car is this one the 2018 Honda Civic Type R, 300 horsepower. Does not come with the beautiful lady. As cool as that car is, it is not the Cadillac CT6 with Super Cruise. Freaking cool red seats and red seat belts. Oh, right. We've gotten a few Hondas in the past, and the the steering, the engineering on these cars are absolutely phenomenal. That's great. And Kathy had a little red Honda for a long time. I did. Yeah, and it was a great car, wasn't it? It was a great car. Yeah. It's gonna take for a spin. I'm gonna go a little ways, and then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna grab the Cadillac, and then I gotta go pick up my dad. <laughs> He's at the hospital, just not feeling that great, but I'm thinking about it. He's doing okay. We'll feel good when he gets in the Cadillac. Yeah, because it's a massive, massive daddy caddy. Daddy caddy, you're picking up your daddy in the caddy. Kathy's in the store, and uh, while she's doing that, I'm just sitting out here with the car. Man, that is a sweet ride right there. Look, 
looks like Kathy found herself a red Jeep. That's the car she wants, but that's a four-door, so, and it's not a Mercedes, like that dude right there. That dude. I don't know, man. I'm digging this car, but uh, I think I'm going to need to go try the Cadillac. Did you get me something yummy? Yeah, I got a new Jeep. You did not. That's a four-door. No, I did not get you anything yummy. So today, it's cool versus classy. Don't worry about me. I'll take out the trash. It's okay. In the Cadillac CT6 now, this is a whole hell of a lot of class. $90,000 of super comfort, tons and tons of bells and whistles. This is the first drive, but I, I kind of feel like I might fall asleep at some point. Thank God I have Super Cruise, which is fully autonomous, only on the freeway. I'm gonna try it out, but probably not today. It's gonna rain for the next couple of days, so probably not in the next couple of days. Sure enough, definitely before the car goes back. My dad didn't really want me to show you him coming out of the hospital. Picked him up in the caddy, the CT6. Uh, that was a great experience because the front seats, man, the front seats have uh, not not just like um, uh, heated seats. They have full-on massage chairs. It was rolling up and down. Oh man, it was, it was incredible. Didn't get a chance to do the Super Cruise. Uh, I'm gonna save that for a little bit later. But let's get into the whole classic versus cool. Uh, let's let's compare because you know you would never compare these two cars like ever, which is kind of why I want to compare them. The Honda, the Honda Type R, this badass red looking car uh, versus the, the dark silver. I don't know what the name of the color is. The Honda, 25 miles per gallon. Caddy, 21 miles per gallon. Winner, Honda. The Honda, 34,770. Five dollars. The Caddy, eighty-eight thousand two hundred ninety-five dollars. Winner Honda. So of course you got a lot of cash flow. Then the winner could be Cadillac. So I mean, you get a lot more car horsepower on the Honda, three hundred horsepower on the Caddy, four hundred and four. Bing Caddy. Technically the Honda has three hundred and six horsepower. So the Honda, a two-liter turbocharged four-cylinder. The Caddy, a three-liter V6 twin turbo. What I like to do is to take that Caddy motor and put it in the Honda. You know, classic versus cool. You, you, you can't really, you can't really compare. I mean, uh, both cars are phenomenal, and uh, I just don't have enough seat time in both of them to really give you an opinion too much. But the first drive, the, you know, they were pretty incredible for the first drives. The Honda is racy, it's uh, phenomenal. You know, every time you pass some guy that you know would be driving a rice rocket, he just kind of gawks. And of course, you put my dad in the Cadillac, and he's just like, <sighs> after five minutes. Plus the Caddy has about 400 foot-pounds so that, that thing scoots like crazy. Later on in the week we'll do some more. Uh, it's gonna be raining so I'm not gonna be able to get out there too much. We're gonna do some indoor vlogs in the next few days. But last and certainly not least we have these watches that I, I revealed to you on a previous vlog just a few days ago. Uh, these are, are from Woodbring watches and they both are spectacular. Uh, trust me, these are freaking awesome. They're $200 watches. Uh, there's a dark one and a light one. I don't know which one is which. Doesn't really matter. But here's the thing. Here's the contest. You guys ready? I need for you to send me, to email me, not to post it on Facebook, not to post it down below, not to put it anywhere else. I need for you to email me a short video clip that's no more than about 15 seconds. And I want you to tell me in that 15 seconds, why I should send these? Why should I send one of these to you? Why, why, why do you need one of these things? Why is time so important to you? How is it that you're gonna look so freaking cool wearing one of these? Now you can record it on your phone, you can record it however you want, but I need for you to, to email me to this askfireball at fireballtim.com. Send it to me because I'm gonna be able to use that clip on, on a vlog coming up pretty soon. If you wanna wear a funny hat, or if you want to wear a pair of funny glasses, I don't really care what you wear, as long as you give me your story. And thus, we'll give everyone the story. You guys know I'm just messing with you, but that's my job. My job is to mess with you. And through that, we'll just have a little bit of fun. But here's the thing. 
If you uh, if you send me one of those videos, and uh, ch chances are there's going to be several really good ones. Not only do you get to win the, the watch, but you get to choose which one you want. You have to tell me which one of these, the dark or the light, the Tokyo or the New York. But also, if you don't win a watch because you sent such a great video, you get to have one of these. Shirts are courtesy of Wrench Nation. Thank you, Frank. You're awesome, buddy. Yeah, look at that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I bet you have. And the cool thing is I have a large and I have a small. And so once again, tell me why I should send you one of these watches. Give me something creative. Give me something good. Tell me, you know, talk to me from your heart. Or lie through your teeth. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Give me a reason to send you one of these watches and I'll send it to you. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching, uh, hanging out with me today. I really enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit up JJ on his raffle. That truck could be yours. Okay, peace out, my brethren.